Hello, lovely people of the internet. I'm the Brittany Canvas, and um, I got rid of my eyebrows today. Ah! Right, so today, I glue sticked my eyebrows up because I will be showing you my Ursula look to the sketch. Ursula was actually based off of a drag queen when they were um, doing the animations and sketches, developing the, the characters of Ursula in The Little Mermaid. So for here, we have a lot of um, height eyebrows. We're gonna draw them up a little bit higher. For the eyebrows we are doing, we're gonna be putting on some little black rhinestones or gems to represent the suction cups on the tentacles. And then we're gonna do also some tentacle work. We're gonna do some little swirls down here on the cheek. And then we're also gonna be doing some gorgeous sexy red lips here. Kind of define it again with the, the cupid's bow and the, the ankle down here. Similar to how we did Maleficent a few weeks back. So I, we need to do something about this. So let's get started. Wrap that all over the island here. Well, there we go. Every 13 year old girl's dream. Blue eyeshadow everywhere. With um, drag makeup, everything is kind of heightened and raised. So we're taking the crease from here and moving it up here to the eyebrow. We have all of our lid. So where you see blue, that's all the lid. Like everything's just bigger. The eyebrow is gonna be incorporated to the crease. So that's gonna help disguise it completely. Because with Ursula, her eyebrows actually point a little bit more towards the center than the end. They're kind of like the like triangles. Alright, so we defined the crease. I also put a little bit of the eyeshadow down on the nose here, just to help really narrow down the nose, because Ursula has a teeny tiny little nose. Now we're going to take our purple cream and go back and just redefine these outer lines we have here. And then to help people in this, then what we're going to do is make sure you have enough on your paintbrush. You're going to have your line here, and then you're just going to take that and you're going to lay your paintbrush flat, and you're just going to stroke down just a little bit just to help blend and feather that into the rest. Just don't make a mistake like that. So yeah, just do little dabs like that around everywhere. It's especially going to help you on the nose too. Alright, so I've just been touching up making sure everything looks the way I would like it to, and I also went ahead and did some really insane little wings here. But it's going to fly away! It's time to bedazzle our face! Alright, so we've bedazzled the face, now we're gonna go on to a little bit of definition on the cheek here. We're gonna take a cheese cake. Okay, so that gives a little, ooh yeah, just like a little like shadow, like a hint of it. Shadows. Alright, so we're doing that, and then we're going to take, oh, my nose is itchy. <laughs> what I'm gonna do actually is I'm gonna outline where I want all of my little swirlies, and then I'm gonna take puff paint, because that's going to elevate a little bit because I don't want this to feel left out, you know, being the only thing that pops up. If I'm having some other design, I want that to pop up. Pop, 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 pop. I want it to pop up too. Pop, puppy. I'm gonna have a big swoop here and then kind of get it smaller. A little swirly sideburn action. <laughs> oh, I'm so itchy. <laughs> so itchy. So itchy. So squishy. So itchy. Alright, so we're going to make two triangles here on our cupid's bow. We're going to go a little bit higher than you normally do. If you want to go high, but you don't want to have the lipstick kind of on your mustache area, which is kind of uncomfortable, what you can also do is just make that line going down, not all the way to the ridge of your lip here. So like, just there. Not exactly covering all your lip so that this looks a little bit more heightened. And we're going to ignore the sides here. So the lip has a more angular shape to it. And I think what I'll be doing to help really define these lines is to do a little bit of a black lip liner around everything. Alright, and that is my Ursula look. I really hope that you liked this video. If you did, please click on that thumbs up button down below and I will see all of you lovelies next time. Bye!